Can crypto coins merge? Since September 15, the Ethereum merge has dominated news coverage. The merge was a once-in-a-lifetime event where proof-of-stake replaced proof-of-work as the Ethereum blockchain consensus method. There is significant misunderstanding, however, regarding what cryptocurrency merges are, what transpired during the Ethereum merge, what it means for the Ethereum blockchain and network, and whether or not other cryptocurrency blockchains can merge as well. What is a cryptocurrency merge? When a specific blockchain network, such as Ethereum, merges a different blockchain with the mainnet, this is known as a cryptocurrency merge or blockchain merge. Simply said, it involves replacing an outdated blockchain protocol with a new one. What happens if a cryptocurrency merges? The consensus mechanism of the underlying blockchain is altered when a cryptocurrency network merges, which affects how transactions are handled and blocks are mined or created. For instance, the Beacon Chain became the main blockchain for the Ethereum network after the Ethereum merge occurred on September 15, 2022. The Genesis Chain, which used proof-of-work to create blocks, carry out transactions, and validate data, was superseded by the Beacon Chain. The Ethereum network now generates blocks using proof-of-stake instead of proof-of-work. The merge is essentially a new consensus mechanism replacing an existing blockchain. All the transactions, information, and accounts from the original execution layer, mainnet, join the new POS consensus layer, also known as the beacon chain, in the background. FAQ. Can crypto coins merge? Cryptocurrency mergers are a phenomenon that hasn't actually happened, particularly in light of the recent merger of the Ethereum blockchain. Additionally, the two separate blockchains have not yet united. For instance, the Ethereum and Bitcoin blockchains can combine. This hasn't happened because the two chains are different from one another, they have different use cases, they can support smart contracts, they can scale, and now they have different consensus processes, POW versus POS. What about a BTC and ETH merge? The inability and unwillingness of the various networks and communities to shift to a whole new blockchain make a combination of Bitcoin and Ethereum theoretically inconceivable. Additionally, it would be impossible given the distinct functions of the two networks and the technical prowess of their individual blockchains. For instance, the Bitcoin blockchain aims to build a peer-to-peer, peer-to-peer, digital currency that can be used for individual transactions without depending on third-party issuers like banks. Furthermore, Bitcoin is now seen as a store of value or virtual gold, moving slightly away from its initial intent. On the other side, Ethereum is touted as a global computer that can support decentralized software and smart contracts. Some of Web3's objectives, such as developing decentralized apps that can replace conventional programs on Windows, iOS, Google Play, and Android, are better served by Ethereum. Therefore, it is hard to think that they could merge into a single network or blockchain because doing so would require joining two different blockchains. Technically speaking, it's also challenging or practically impossible to achieve because each blockchain has a unique genesis block. In order to combine, they would both need to hard fork and join forces on a new blockchain. This would lead to issues like naming the new cryptocurrency and how the blockchain would come to consensus. Merging cryptocurrencies through bridges. The merge in the conventional sense of Ethereum is conceivable, but not between independent chains, such as when Bitcoin and Dogecoin are combined with Ethereum. There is a means for cryptocurrency currencies to merge with other blockchain networks, known as crypto bridges, however it isn't quite a merge, per the definition given above. Crypto bridges are centralized third-party services that combine cryptocurrency coins or tokens from various blockchains. Crypto bridges are used to use ETH on other chains like Arbitrum as well as to bring BTC onto the Ethereum network. Crypto bridges are advantageous because they enable the use of distinct native blockchain coins like Bitcoin for DeFi applications on Ethereum.